there's a college basketball talk. And uh, this guy named Todd Golden has been accused of multiple by multiple women for harassment and stalking. And Todd Golden's status as Florida men's basketball coach has not changed and will be coaching the game tonight. <clears throat> so what's your take on this? Because he came out and said, for the last month, I have actively participated in, and respected the confidentiality of ongoing school inquiry. I have recently engaged. <clears throat> I, I have recently engaged Ken Turkle to advise me on my ability to bring defamation claims while this confidential investigation is ongoing. My family and I appreciate the support we have received and remain confident the university will continue its efforts to finish its review promptly. End quote. That's Todd Golden's re, uh, <clears throat> statement, the head basketball coach of the uh, Florida Gators. The alligator also spoke with two separate women's, uh, women who attested to Golden's behavior and requested to remain anonymous, of course, for safety reasons. Since the investigation began, there was a small amount of action that was taken by UF. Florida University, both women said small amounts of action because it probably hasn't come out with any significant factual evidence. And you probably possibly assuming Lee lying. The first woman at Florida, a former student said that Golden stalked her in person, both in his car and on foot, and that this occurred more than 10 times. So listen, all the women out there, I don't want to discredit you that that, it, that the women that actually have this happen by weirdo, creepy men, I do know it exists. I get it. Trust me. I understand there's some weirdo, creepy fucking men out there that do this all the time. So I don't want to discredit the real women that actually have this happen. Let me be clear first. That's number one. Number two, the women that lie more often than not about type of thing like this just to capture some sort of insta famous or money it's usually some sort of money involved uh, you guys are bottom feeders man you should be ashamed of your motherfucking self the players that i've had that you've put behind bars falsely and the people that you claim have done you wrong just to gain fame or money or fucking some sort of insurance claim or any of that you guys are bottom feeders. You guys are bottom feeders. And you should be ashamed of yourself. And you should go to jail. And that's just a fact. Now, if this coach, and I want to put it in context, if the head basketball coach at Florida really has the time to stalk a former student 10 multiple times, then he's a weirdo, creepy fuck. Now, pause. For one second, let me pause this picture. <laughs> I'm a good judge of character. I got to be real with you. You know me. I'm a realist. That motherfucker looks weird. <laughs> he looked like a fucking weirdo. I I'm going to be honest with you. I'm just throwing that out there. <laughs> he looks weird. That motherfucker looks creepy. He looks like a weirdo, creepy fuck. I'm going to be real with you and tells you that shit right now. I'm going to tell you, he looks like a weirdo. That's why I said, women, <laughs> I don't want to discredit you. If it happened, it happened. But that motherfucker looks weird. I would never hire this motherfucker because of how he looks if I was AD at Florida. That's me. <laughs> I don't give a fuck how good of a coach he is. He looks weird, homie. I, I don't see how this motherfucker can recruit anybody of significance. Could he go get a, like a? Al Horford? Could he go recruit like Joakim Noah? Could he have gotten those players at Florida? Or is he just getting any motherfucker now? Is he getting any motherfucker now because NIL bags are paying? Are they just hiring weirdo motherfuckers? Listen, would I be shocked if this motherfucker was stalking this girl? Nope. Not after seeing this motherfucker's side profile. <laughs> I, I'm gonna be honest. I wouldn't. I wouldn't be shocked after watching this motherfucker's side profile. I, 
I wouldn't. <laughs> I'm going to be real. I'm not going to be shocked. But am I shocked at the females who falsely accuse the men either? No. But I'm going to be honest. I want to know how this dude as the head basketball coach has the time to stalk a girl on campus knowing he's the head basketball coach and everybody in the country or on that campus would know he's the head basketball coach. How is he really out there false or uh, stalking a female and no one else knows it? That's the problem I have. I got to be honest. How did he do it 10 times and nobody noticed the head basketball coach on campus walking after a girl plenty of times? I just, I, I got to be honest. I don't see it. I don't see it. But again, this motherfucker looks weird. I'm going to be honest. He looks like a fucking weirdo. <laughs> he looks like a fucking weirdo. So it is what it is. All right, let's talk some college football, man. College football, uh, real quick, before I get to my top of the world, bottom of the barrel, uh, brought to you by Bet US. Um, a lot going on. 